Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you a little update on my planted tank here in the 30 gallon. My two dwarf Grammys. There. And we had we had six uh, white cloud minnows and uh, uh, one of them died last week which was not that big of a deal. I've had the two for a long time so one of them was probably just old age. And then I got another guppy right there and uh, my other guppy the one we've had a little longer she actually I, I don't know what you guys think but I know she's still got her gravid spot and it's still really dark and she's still really big but it's been like almost a week since she had these uh, her her babies her her fry so there's one there's four in here but uh, I don't know about anybody else. If you have experience with this, like, how long can a guppy stay with her gravid spot before she's popped out all her fry? I'd love to hear what, how many. I couldn't find any info on the internet with all the research I've been doing. But I've also got a whole bunch of ghost shrimp in here now, too. There's one, two, three, four, five five or six on the back wall there. They like climbing on the algae, so I leave algae on the back wall. But uh, it's also a lot of, a good source of food for them while they hang out in there. And my plants, they're just doing so fantastically. See this ocelot sword? All these leaves are new. I, you can't, I think there's only one in the background behind there that you can't really see right now that was on the plant before I bought it. And it's just huge and I've had it for about a month. And then my red flame sword, all of the ones at the store that are that were are still there are that big and it's up here. So they stopped about that size and all my new leaves are four or five, maybe even six times the size of the others, which is awesome. And then my red tiger lotus is starting to grow too, which is pretty exciting. But the other day we saw at the pet store these figure eight puffer fish. So I had this tank cycling here and here he is. They're so cool. I really like puffer fish. They seem very personable and intelligent. Yeah. Seems very smart. I like watching his eyes. He looks around. You see them darting in different directions and even sometimes blink. A really interesting little fish. And my cats are crashing around the house. But uh that's what that's the update for today and I'll leave you guys with a little clip of this guy eating a mealworm. Have a good one guys.